That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. This is so inspiring. I'm gonna make my own space agency. Will you get away from that TV? Sure you're gonna grow up to be nothing but a feckin' YouTuber. Dad, stop! That's a horrible thing to say! Alright, here we are, back at the Kerbal Space Program. Let's get started. We're gonna make some fine inventions today. Let's start a new sandbox game. We'll call it Guesswork. <laughs> we'll use this flag that says NASA will be called the Narthat Lone Space Agency. <laughs> it's the Irish department. It's got nothing to do with NASA. It's NASA. I am determined to use this external command seat this time, so I'm gonna try that. Okay, I've put a little ladder up to it now. I, I hope this will work. I don't see why not. <laughs> Alright, what if we just launch it like this? I want to see, can he get on the side? Alright, let, let go of that. Come on. Ugh, come on, gravity. Kick in. Oh, <gasps> it works! This is perfect! Look at him, he doesn't have a clue what's about to go down. I didn't either, apparently. It just doesn't work. Okay, let's actually design something now that I know I can use those seats. I kind of just stuck parts together and went, that'll do. Why are we funding this? Wait, why are we on the runway? I don't think a runway is needed for this, but anyway, <laughs> that's fine. Jesus, he has some grip. Is there no gravity here either? Oh no, there's gravity. Oh, the poor fecker, he fell over. What the hell? What's wrong with him? Get on the feckin' seat, come on! This is your job! <laughs> He's probably looking at that rocket booster above it like, but I don't wanna... Look at him! He's just staring into it! Alright, don't worry, that's not gonna activate, that's just for show, look! See? Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! It activated! I think it feckin' killed him! <laughs> he just exploded in the sky! There we go. That's why they call them unmanned drones. <laughs> you just blast a man off it in the sky, then it's unmanned. I mean, it's technically right. Okay, we definitely need it to be more symmetrical. I think that's the issue. There we go. I don't think they're even at all. And even the ladder is crooked. <laughs> Imagine you were an astronaut and you were boarding your rocket and the ladder was crooked. <laughs> You'd be like, hmm, I'm starting to doubt the workmanship on this thing. Okay, my inspiration for this is the Spire in Dublin. It's an Irish national landmark. But it's also inspired by a roller coaster. <laughs> Alright, let's get me a crew. <laughs> uh, we need some more recruits. The more stupid, the better, please. Uh, you got a lot of courage, you can come, even though you're smart. I've got all pilots, one scientist. He can be the token scientist who's going, I'm telling you, you can't go through with this! And I'm the big CEO who's like, I've got to impress the board, we're going through with this! <laughs> Wait, I can only put one on? But I've got so many seats! Alright, I'm gonna have to add more cockpits and then just get them out of there. I guess we'll just have to make it longer. <laughs> God help them when they actually have to get out of this thing, because there's no stairs down. They're just gonna tumble down. Alright, fill those seats, boys. Let's Let's go. Look at that long boy. It's amazing how it even stands up. It's got one engine to propel all of this. All right, get out. No, let go. It's like we're on the moon. You can get out. Don't worry. <laughs> no gravity. <laughs> oh, feck. <laughs> he got the other guy off of it. All right, let's get all of our men out first, I suppose. Hatch is obstructed. Cannot get out. Oh, you poor soul. All right, you know what? We can even it out with two. That's fine. I don't know how that person is ever going to get out, though. Like, we're going to launch it with the feckin' hatch obstructed. Okay, we've got two men there. And then three in here. Two of them are stuck in it. And one of them is the pilot. <laughs> this is promising. I will be so disappointed if this doesn't even launch. Feck! Go! Go! That's not going! What's even happening? Okay, we're going! The guys are dead before it even took off! It's like a hit and run! They killed the guys and they're like, Shit! Let's get out of here before the popo shows up! It's turning strangely, I don't know why. I wonder if my ladders aren't exactly symmetrical. Imagine having to escape afterwards, the ladders would be feckin' red hot. The engines are pointed right onto them. Not that the ladder will do you much good anyway, since it only goes up about a meter of the 50 meter long aircraft. Oh my god, why is it turning so much? I don't know what's happening. This is actually behaving like a plane, except for the fact that, you know, it's doing constant barrel rolls. <laughs> now it's tilted downwards, though. That's not so much like a plane. It's a bit too extreme. Okay, we're going quite fast. Still happy out by the looks of it. They don't seem to mind. Oh, I can make them get out. Bail! Bail! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, they didn't last long. Oh <laughs> uh, well, might be better off. <laughs> 
they just went poof into smoke. I wonder if I could build like a plane and do parachuting courses. That would be profitable for NASA. Okay, clearly the space gods are trying to say that I should build a plane rather than a spacecraft, which is easily done. You just, how would you build a plane? Okay, we'll have this guy like looking at the wheels so that he can make sure they're okay. This will be for the passengers. This is what goes on planes, right? I know they may not be to scale, but it's close enough. Okay, this should make sure it's tilted. I'll just put a load of these on. There we go. It definitely shouldn't tip sideways <laughs> or anything, right? All right, let's see how that does. Let's go, Jebediah. <laughs> he must be so scared. I'm scared of planes too, buddy. Don't worry. Okay, fantastic. I think this is the time I should be using the runway, but no problem. Let's just aim at the building and go. Go. Go and go. Go. Yes, we're taking off. Oh, that's the bit where it decoupled. <laughs> <laughs> the bits that were supposed to come off came off anyway, that's for sure. Jebediah's still happy. Bit of a rough landing, but I'm fine. <laughs> All right, maybe planes aren't for me. <laughs> I don't think this game is for me. I don't think life is for me. Oh, now I made myself sad. All right, you know what? Let's try it again. It's not hopeless. There's definitely something that can be done. Oops, not that though. All right, now we have one engine because I removed it by accident. Okay, this will just have to hold it, and then we'll drop it and immediately go. All right, let's try it, Jebediah. Oh yeah, Jebediah's dead. Okay, let's get someone else. You're all hired, guys. Jobs just opened up. Easy does it now. Easy. Three, two, one, go. Not bad. <laughs> I destroyed the entire launch pad. I basically just dropped a bomb on it. Burly Kerman is just like, everything is fine. <laughs> Time to get started with my parachuting business, just like I dreamed. All right, what we need is a slightly slower plane. So we need something small that will launch up, then turn and go horizontal. And then the troops deploy. Let's get started. Okay, if I weigh it down with these and this wheel, then it should turn this way, right? <laughs> That's how rockets work, right? They just put a wheel to weigh it down. I should know, I invented NASA. All right, there we go. And a nice steady ladder going to the seats. Okay, this is looking pretty good. I like it. Okay, we got two seats. Go on, a pilot and a scientist. Good old Jebediah is back for more. Oh yeah, the launch pad is nuked. Uh, can I swap to the other style? Ah, this should do it. Okay, I hope you guys are ready. Well, let's get you in the seats. All right, board that seat. Perfect, good job. Oh, fecker! Out of the way, you eejit. Come on, get out of the way. We got space things to do. Oh, I'm turning the wheel. Oh, that's handy. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's handy. All right, let's go. Come on, Jebediah. Don't let her push you around. You take your seat. You sit there proudly. He probably jumped off. He's like, oh no, I've fallen and I can't get up. All right, here we go. Launch. Perfect. The parachutes are deployed. I don't think this is how parachuting works, guys. Believe me, I just opened this parachute business. I know how these things work. Wait, how do I get you out of here? Cut parachute. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, she's left the seat. Oh, God, my parachute business is going to fail. It's going to get horrible marketing. Was that the splash from him entering the ocean? By Christ, Jebediah, you are thick. <laughs> it's just floating there like a dead fish. Ah, I've loved my parachute experience. Five star on TripAdvisor. I'm pretty sure he's dead. Oh wait, no, he's good. He's good. He was just lying there. All right, we can swim. We can swim. Let's go recover the wreck that's only 280. You know what? No, you can feckin' be stranded there. Feck that. Oh, look at them all the way over there. Poor little things. Anyway, let's continue on. NASA stops for no man. Okay, I'm liking my design so far, but what they're lacking is fun. They need to be a bit more fun. There we go, nice and symmetrical. I hope this is actually like welded together and they're not just sitting there and they'll fall apart. Very good. Look at this, this is going very well. This is gonna be fun. There we go. We ordered one of the parts the wrong size. <laughs> the rest of it is perfectly sized and this bulge just comes out. Or I could use this one, perfect. Okay, now it even looks weirder. Ladders aren't Nisa's strong point. Look at them, they're so crooked. It's extremely worrying. Oh, look at all these people willing to sign up. Stupidity full, yeah. <laughs> Join the crew. Oh yeah, my launch pad is fecked, I forgot. Uh, swap to the other one then. Oh, get ready for the best roller coaster ride of your life. Oh no, 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 don't hit him. Oh, for feck's sake. I feckin' hate that. It, why is it turning by itself? It's moving. We should probably take off before anything else happens. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I think it's too heavy, sir. 
Oh, now I have to go back, add more rockets, then come back out here and put them all in their seats again. God damn it. Right, that should be enough. But the crew might be trapped in there. Actually, that's probably a bad idea. Right, that should be okay. It might burn the people below, but it should be okay. Uncertainty is fine when it comes to rocket science. Oh my god, it's very unstable. It just moves around for no reason. No, 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 no. Be very careful. Oh, phew, he probably just gave himself brain damage. I was worried he'd hurt someone. <laughs> I think that's just from walking into it. It's that unstable. I mean, it is a bit top heavy <laughs> when you really look at it. These things sometimes get past quality control with spacecraft. Look at this. It's turning just from him trying to move. Let's see if this works. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Yes. Look at them. Why is it not turning? It should be turning. Oh God, it's turning way too much and it's turning the wrong way. Oh wait, it's correcting. It's correcting. It's not corrected. I think my guys are still good though. And like we are going more up than down. Oh. Now we're going more down than up. I gotta escape at least one of them. Leave seat. Oh, phew. Deploy, shoot. Ah, oh, we made it. Another successful mission. Oh my god, how many explosions are gonna happen? Ah, oh, the world's beautiful from up here. Sure, there was a lot of money spent and a lot of lives lost, but isn't it all worth it for this? Look how happy he is. And gently, okay, gently face plant. Can we get a freeze frame jump for the credits? He fell over. <laughs> I want his attitude. I just want to be that positive that even when all your friends die in a space crash, you're out stranded here and you've fallen and you can't get up. You're still smiling. All right. Well, I think we're going to end it here. I hope you enjoyed our adventures with NASA. I enjoyed some of her inventions. I do think that putting people on the outside of the spacecraft is probably not the best route. But hey, these things are trial and error. That's what space travel is all about. Just get right back on that horse. <laughs> all right. Well, I'll end it there. I hope you enjoyed. Appreciate you as always, folks. And I guess I'll see you next time. Bye for now. <laughs>